It was the year of Felicity Huffman. The Golden Globes came a call in. Her role on Housewives is always complex, but tackling the role of a transsexual man in Trans America was the challenge of her career, as Sean Robinson found out. What's up with that? It's just a little rig for this DV camera. So it's like a steady cam? Uh, yeah, basically. Felicity Huffman acts as Hollywood camera person? You look fantastic, darling. <laughs> Yes, the Desperate Housewife took matters into her own hands just before our interview. That's my team. All right, I'm done. Thanks. <laughs> Felicity was in high spirits here. Are you a boy or a girl? But for her new film, Trans America, she took herself back to a very dark place in order to play a transsexual man who was about to have surgery to permanently become a woman. So how do you approach a role like this? Can you imagine feeling like that, that, you know, you are in kind of the wrong body? Yes, but uh, what I had to do is break it down into something that I had experienced. Which was? I've certainly experienced self-loathing. I've certainly experienced extreme self-consciousness, that you don't belong, that you're an outsider, that, that you're an oddball. I can't handle this. Felicity now admits in her early 20s that self-loathing manifested itself into an eating disorder. She was both bulimic and anorexic. At one point, weighing just 98 pounds, at age 29, she then suffered a deep depression that lasted for four years. You talked about your depression. Did you feed from that? Did you sure. get energy from that, oh, that yeah. time in your life? Oh, yeah, yeah. How could you not? Somebody looks at you and say, how could you possibly be in that place? It's an excellent point, and, and it's true. I'm the luckiest girl in the universe, and I'm the first one to say it. I am blessed and lucky, and I have only things to be joyful and grateful about. And the truth of the human soul is you hit despair, and you hit depression, and you hit self-loathing, and you hit all those things. And uh, I don't know exactly how you can be alive and not experience that if you let yourself be fully in the world. Right now, it's time for scandals, feuds, couch jumping, things that suck.